Hi, and welcome back to City View. I'm Danny Nelson. In this episode, Transport expands its service, you can exhibit your artwork, and City Park Pool goes to the dogs. Starting August 27th, Transport will provide bus service every day of the year. The added service is on Sundays and holidays from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. on Max and routes 2, 3, 8, 14, and 16. The expanded service is funded by the City of Fort Collins, the Associated Students of Colorado State University, and the CSU Administration. Check RideTransport.com for schedules and all the details. The new Walk and Wheel Skills Hub opens to the public this month. The hub is a miniature city complete with streets, bike lanes, a roundabout, traffic signs, and more. Children and adults can use the hub to practice safe cycling and walking skills and gain confidence using these transportation alternatives. The hub is located right off of the Spring Creek Trail near Drake and Dunbar. Join the ribbon cutting celebration August 30th. Learn more at fcgov.com bicycling. Celebrate local art at the Community Creative Center's annual open hang exhibit. Local artists will fill the center with their paintings, sculptures, and decorative pieces August 16th through the 26th. Artists of all ages and skills are invited to participate. Learn how to submit your work at fcgov.com slash creative center. The exhibit is open from noon to 6 p.m. Wednesdays through Saturdays and admission is free. City Park Pool is closing out the summer by inviting your dog for a swim. Don't miss the Pooch Plunge on Sunday, August 27th, where dogs from across town will get the opportunity to splash around and enjoy the dog days of summer. Please note that people are no longer permitted in the pool and must enjoy their dog swim from the sidelines. Tickets are on sale now at Epic and Mulberry Pools. And for more information, you can visit fcgov.com recreation. Governor John Hickenlooper will speak at the city's fifth annual Business Appreciation Breakfast, September 13th. The breakfast celebrates area businesses for their contributions to a healthy Fort Collins economy and is sponsored by the city's Economic Health Office. The Gratitude is Good Business event will also feature Mayor Wade Troxell, City Manager Darren Atterbury, and a panel of business leaders. The event is free, but registration is required at fcgov.com business. That's today's show. Check back August 21st for our next episode. Catch up on previous episodes at fcgov.com slash fctv or on our YouTube channel. I'm Danny Nelson. Thanks for watching City View.